Gula. Thank you. Mine is to join um, General on the issue of Kenya by stating that we hope that with the current impasse regarding the election uh, is resolved peacefully and loss of life will be avoided. On the question whether we have faith in the institutions, um, I think for us it's what we've stated that whilst capacity is there in the institutions from your SARS, the Reserve Bank, the Office of the Public Protector, what we are concerned about is that it should not take 70 days for SARS to indicate whether um, the taxes were paid in Palapal. Anyone knows and everyone here can know, in fact knows that laws have been broken. The president abused his powers by instructing someone who's there to protect him to go and investigate theft on his private farm. That is abuse of power. That one is clear. The constitution is also very clear that members of cabinet cannot undertake any paid work. The president in one of the ANC conferences clearly stated that um, the money that was stolen, it was proceeds from the sale of animals. Now, laws have been broken. However, we do not have a sense that these institutions are doing right by the Constitution and the people of our country. That is why we feel it necessary for, as opposition parties, to act. Had these institutions done what is required by the law, we would not be here. Look at the issue of the acting public, in fact, the deputy public protector. We have a case whereby she nicotimously went to the uh, president. They agree on an extension on, um, the, on the answering of the 31 questions. It's only after the public were raising concerns, she issues a statement to, uh, to inform the public that um, she has granted the president an extension. Now, after um, we, know we made noise as opposition parties, the president requests, requests another extension. And it is only after again we made noise that um, that extension was not granted. Therefore, we are dealing with a case where of a president in power might not be held to the same standards as if it was another person. That is why we believe that with the motion of no confidence and Ramaphosa is out of that office, this investigation from your SARS to the Reserve Bank, from your Hawks, Office of the Public Protector, can be independently done. Thank you. President Lukota. 